Okay, after way too long trying to figure that out, I think I got the audio up and running. I'm not sure what I did, but I, I restarted a bunch of things and eventually it, it started working again, so. So you know what? Whatever works. What whatever whatever gets the job done. Here it is. I'm not gonna read the manual again because I forgot that the game has an opening crawl. I, I misremembered, I thought it didn't. So we're just gonna include that and you can get the story. Okay, here we go, here we go. Dracula has arrived. Dracula is looking to be reborn ever since his castle was destroyed. As a result of his battle with Christopher, Fifteen years later, a ceremony is held honoring Soliu, the son of Christopher, who will be the next vampire hunter. Dracula has been waiting for this time because in order to return to Earth, he must use the power of Soliu. The next day, a four castles appear while Soliu disappears into the fog. And now a new battle must begin. The battle must engage. So it sounds like we're good now. All right, go in. 1991. So as you can see, forecastle is here. Switch those controls. I don't want it. I don't want it! I gotta open Chatty back up. Aw, oh, crap. Where is this? Because see, I thought I wasn't gonna do this no more. But then, I figured it out. And here it is. Just had to type a thing real quick. <clears throat> Alright, get your snoops ready, because this is going to be good. Crystal Castle. For the 2600. So, I, I definitely consider this game a marked improvement over the first one. And hopefully you will see why. Bird. Bur ow. Yeah, because there's birds, you see. That's how you know it's better. 
because Alfred Hitchcock was involved. Oh, and there's sub-weapons now. Yes, I can actually throw the axe. I could still do this, though. Oh, do I want that? Do I want the holy water? Well, it won't let me down to get it. Okay. Ooh. Song's so good. Oh, no, the coin. Oh, whatever. Whatever. Okay, now what's what's down there? Ugh. Okay, get the axe again. You know what? That's fine. That's fine. I wanted it. Pole jump. You know, when they talk about pole vaulting, I don't think this is what they mean. Ugh. That feels bad. That's not a good jump to make. Oh, it's the Mermen! They're here! Contractually obligated Mermen. I don't know what that was I just grabbed. It was- it was something, probably. Oh, the- it's the head- the hand-looking thing. It, it, it looks like a hand, honestly, going like... Yeah, been a little bit since I played some cats. Oh god, it's the eyeballs. You thought they were gone, but no, they're still here. Oh, god. Okay. Oh, the the walls are closing in. Hold up, Potato Man, or we're done for. In the hole. Anything over here? Any cool secrets? No. How about over here? Mm -hmm. No. Okay. Wait one sec. Okay, I don't want to get poked. Don't get needled. Don't get needled. Don't get needled, Christopher. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Is there... I think there's something, like, up here. Or at least I thought there was. You can go down fast, but you can't go up fast, so... This music is badass. Hell yeah, it is. Hey, Kovar. Like I said, thought, thought I wasn't going to be able to do this today, but I solved the problem a bit quicker than I was expecting to. So you know what? You know what? We're going YOLO, as the kids say. Do the kids still say that? I don't know. I haven't been around a kid in a while. Ow. I feel like there's a secret around here. Oh wait, it's the it's the splody boys, I think. You gotta make them explode. Okay, man, no, maybe not here. Oh, that was a that was a pit. That was that was a pit that you're not you're not supposed to go into that pit. Okay, well that's embarrassing. Oh, oh, nope. Oh, you can just- you can do it from the ground. Yeah, this- this gameplay is not stellar so far. 
I am not bringing honor to the family. But, you know, I'm... I'm okay with that. I can I can live with a little bit of embarrassment. It, it's good for you. It builds up the humors. No, actually, I might be thinking of something in the first game. I don't know. Secrets are fun, and I like to find them. Okay, yeah, that does a lot of damage. Do not let that hit you. Yeah, yeah, not stellar gameplay from Dustin so far. Not, not stellar. I haven't seen any wall meat either, which is, does not bode well for me. Okay, okay, here we go. Here we go, you ready? You ready? Go to the door. Go to the door. Not stellar level design either. I mean, I think it's fine. How goes the adventure so far? Not good. I am not playing well. But other than that, pretty good. Uh-oh. Oh, I can do that on the ladder. Okay. Oh, no, I'm dead. Oh, how am I alive? Oh, it doesn't do a lot of damage at all. Will Christopher be able to live? Not if the bat touches him. Come on, Chrissy boy. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. You can make it through. I don't know what this is. It needs to die immediately. That's how I react to things I don't understand. As many people in the world do. Those are Metroids. You know, it sure did look like it. Yeah, I'm not- I'm really not sure how I'm still alive at this point. That's how you know something serious is about to happen. If I can beat this boss without getting hit, I will- I will poop. Yeah, that's about what I expected to happen. You have to fight the wizard! The thunder wizard. Okay, see, that's the trick. That's the trick. Okay, so he's more vulnerable while he's appearing. So that encourages you to use this moment to get away. And there we go, the wizard has been taken care of. Oh, you didn't even let me grab that. What kind of Castlevania game is this? Okay, so, we did that, castle's destroyed. Let's just go in uh, clockwise order. This one might have some flashing, so if you're epileptic, you may not want to look at this one. And I'll explain why it has that in a second. 
Yeah, so you see this back here? Very unpleasant to look at. But the reason it's like that is because they assumed that this would be played on an original Game Boy. And the ghosting would make that look like a different shade. Also, this music's also awesome. Yeah, exactly what Kovar said. On an original Game Boy, it, it would look fine. But when you're playing it in HD, on the, one of them fancy new displays, it, it don't look so, it don't look so hot. And unfortunately, neither the OSSC or the Retro Tank has any means of rectifying this. I'm not convinced there's any song in this game that is not a banger. Oh, crap. Castlevania composers were ripped, dude. They knew what was up. Oh, did I want the axe? I have no idea. You know, this is, apparently has, like, Super Game Boy palette stuff, but I'm mostly seeing a lot of red so far. Like, like if you go here, if you look in the bottom left corner there, go to the palette. See, it has this, which means, like, it has special programming. But, yeah, like I said, mostly just seeing a lot of red. I mean, I like red. Red's a nice color. I forgot if the world map was different. Oh, more spikes. Except these are coming from the floor. I didn't mean to do that. Also, you notice there's like a little white gap. That's because Game Boy only has one background layer. So they have to share. I'm scared to jump. And rightfully so. Well, I got one life, so it doesn't it doesn't bode well for me right now. Can you go up here? No, there's nothing up there. I mean, you can go up there. There's nothing special to be had if you do. But it it, it can be done. Okay, so don't jump. Do not jump that. <laughs> just fall. I mean, it looks like you're gonna get hit, but just fall. Uh-oh, the Metroids is back. The evil jellies. Love this part of the song. Okay, this one you can jump. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, be careful about that. Merp. Merp. Yeah, that's right. I said merp. That's that hand thing's name, by the way. Merp. At least that's what I've just decided. Okay, now what's going on over here? Okay, I'll take the axe. Why not? I don't know what I need. I don't know what's good for me. Uh-oh, it's Firebrand. You're in the wrong game, pal. The red are remember. Oh, crap. Does this conveyor belt change direction? Thank you. 
I don't know what that rope over there is for. Whoop. Okay. Got the splitting, splitting blades of death. You know. I'll, I will take care of this man remotely. I'm... I like to work from home. Spikes up there that I, I do not understand the purpose of. Like, you you can jump into those spikes if you want to. You know? Uh, the options there. Oh, God. Oh, God. Makes your eyes water a little bit. Ugh. I'm I'm scared of that, honestly. Oh, okay, I got it. I got it. Okay, there there we go. No, wait for it to come back. Be patient. Be patient. And you will be rewarded. With eye strain. I I let that fall into the abyss. Okay, can I defeat the boss in one life? That is the question. Or Yeah, I got one life. Uh, never mind, I have two lives. Oh, the platforms. Board the platforms. Oh yeah, this looks this looks fun. Uh-oh. It's the skeleton head. Oh, he shoots he shoots the boomerangs. Okay. I don't remember ever fighting this boss. Uh uh oh. You gotta go down. Yeah, so you gotta you just gotta maneuver past Oh, and they recombine on the other side. That's that's really cool, honestly. No, you die. Perish. Jeremy Parrish, NES works. Game Boy works. Because that's more thematically appropriate. <laughs> Jeremy Parrish and his arch, enem arch enemy, John Prosper. Okay, now, over here. Yeah, this- this is a lot of red. This is a lot of red. I really like this song. But here, here, I need to- I need to make a more appropriate palette. There we go. That's- now that's a plant. That's a plant castle. Looks a little minty. Like a frog instead of a fleeman. Somehow missed it first that this is a Super Game Boy. Not only that, it is a Super Game Boy 2. <laughs> because I can't help myself. No, no, no! I wanted that. Ow. God, this entire soundtrack is nothing but bangers. Is the Super Game Boy 2 also too fast? No, that is one of the things that they changed about it. I mean, the main thing is they added... <laughs> they added Link Cable. That was the main purpose. I think they, you know, Pokemon came out and it was really popular and then all of a sudden it was a problem that they didn't put a Link Cable on it. So, they made a second one with the link cable. Uh-oh. I... Well, okay, I'm not going up there, then. They also changed, like, they added some borders. Some new borders. The old ones are still in here, but you have to input, like, a secret code to get them.
money. Anything cool down here? Not really. Oh, wall meat, finally! Oh no. It's the trapeze bones. Pardon me, I burp. Doing the rope groove. Nope, die. See, I got that new remote whip. You know, because I like to work from home. That's kind of my thing, you know? Ow. I got that Bluetooth whip. Uh oh. <laughs> well, I was not prepared for that. This is probably the best way to deal with it. Oh no, jellyfish. Do we need them? They're they're ninety nine percent water. Just add one percent, make them water. Uh oh, the tentacles are undulating. They are undulating. I don't know. That might be like grassy thing, moss grass. I don't know what it is. Either way, I'm not I'm not going down there if I can help it. Except to get this candle. The trick. The trick is you don't actually want to attack the eyeball. Oh, okay, you don't want to do that either. No, you know, I better get that. I better get that. You gotta go. Eh. You gotta get a bit of a running start, you know? Okay, never mind. I gotta... I actually gotta make a hole. Ow. Get me out of here. Do not want to be in the eyeball zone any longer than I must. There we go. Wall meat. It's what's for dinner. Whether you like it or not. And we have introduced spider. They create web that you can climb. That's pretty cool. Okay, so get them when they're real down low. So that you can have ma maximum climb. Oh, did not mean to throw that. The eyeball production factory. This is where he makes them. Well, crap. My aim is abysmal. What is this? Oh, it's, it's hard. It might have been a whip upgrade. Oh. Thank you for the sub. Prime sub. I mean, you can have spare eyeballs. You can't do much with them, but you can have them. Oh, the trident men. Okay, so... 
This seems pretty simple so far. Honestly, I think that this game has a much lower difficulty level than its predecessor. I mean, I'm not complaining, though. Because it's it, the last one was kind of cock and ball torture. Christopher Belmont torture. So I don't mind having a bit of an easier ride for the second one. Okay, last castle. The rock castle. I think it should be brown. It drains your health before it fills it back up. I'm guessing it awards you points for how much you have left, but... You know, they can only fit so much in the HUD. Hey, it's the Mudmen. They're back. And muddier than ever. There's holes. Sigourney Weaver would probably be happy about this. Nope. 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 Oh, this. This whole thing. Wasn't that in the first game, too? I don't remember. Could have been. Okay, the gameplay has improved. It has improved. Since the last I have done it. Oh, no you don't. No you don't. You know, I, I, whatever's in that candle, I don't need it. No, 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 no. Don't need to go down there. <laughs> More ropes than the last world of SMV2. Yeah, for whatever reason, the Game Boy games, you know, got rid of Castlevania's iconic stairs in favor of rope. Not sure why. Maybe it was just easier to program. Oh, no, not darkness gimmick. I hate darkness gimmick. Oh, the candles actually are what lights the way. Oh, well, poop. The rock bug knocked me in a hole. So you have to- you have to be strategic about what candle you allow. You allow to be broken. Oh god, the eyeballs. There's so many eyeballs. Ah, uh, crap. Oh! The bugs come to life when it's dark. So if you keep it lit, they don't- they don't do that. They ain't do it. I have created a problem.
Okay, and now, now we're done with that whole shebang. And we're starting with this one. Welcome to the Crusher. And of course, even when he is threatened by... <laughs> you notice how the rope moves up and down with it? Right here. But even when he is under threat of being crushed, Christopher cannot be bothered to walk more than this speed. Listen, I'm, I'm just gonna say it. The Game Boy had a couple limits. You know? <laughs> that may be a, a controversial statement, but... It was not all-powerful. That their way of overcoming sprite limits. Well, I'm guessing they're both part of the background. Or, or maybe the rope is a sprite, and that's how they got around, you know, the fact that they only have one background layer. I don't know. I would have to go in with, like, an emulator and fool around with the layers to see what they're doing. They're definitely doing something funky. Because you don't- you don't have a moving object that big on the Game Boy. It has to be a background. Uh-oh. The Samurai. Uh-oh, now he's the Super Samurai. Uh-oh. Okay, Super Samurai not actually that strong. He's only... He's only super by a little bit. The thing is... 0.1 times 2 is still just gonna be 0.2. You know? It's not gonna be that... that much stronger. And there we go. The real castle. Okay, now this is probably my favorite song in the whole game, but it's it's hard to choose. Oh look, it's a statue. It looks like a lady with bunny ears. No you don't. Birds are not allowed. Uh-oh, it's the Mini Reaper. Ow. Gotta love this part. I, I, I need to jump that, you know. It would probably be wise to jump that. And there's gonna be another Reaper Man up here. The Repo Man. Any meat? Any hidden meats? Nope. Okay. I mean, I'm not in that dire need. Oh, and here we go with this. Nose is itchy, ah. Hey, this is just the same setup you had earlier. Yes, I did it! 
I have actually dodged the attack. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Ow. And yet I did not dodge that. Who would have thunk? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> well, see, now I'm in trouble because I don't got the axe no more. Oh, well, well, we'll make do. Belmont boys make do. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. I'm fine. I am actually cool. There we go. Now we got it. It is back. We have returned. Ow. Ow. You know, you know, we don't need it. We don't need it. Wait for it, wait for it to come back. You know what, the axe is the best way to deal with these guys. Oh, no! What Yoshi's new island would have sounded like back in the day. I mean, almost certainly better than what it actually does sound like. Not that that is a feat. Nintendo... <laughs> or our Zest composers be like, Yeah, this is the worst music I've ever heard. Ship it. And, and all because they just, they want Yoshi to be childish. They want it to be a very childlike game. So they make the worst music you've ever heard in your life. That's pretty cool right there. That whole setup. Meat. Meat. Yoshi's New Island and Sonic Superstar. Same dev, entirely opposite music. Yeah, that's because they have Mr. Lope. They have Mr. Lope on their team. I mean, and Jun Sunue, who is a good composer when he is not being told to replicate Genesis music. Okay, not the one I intended to hit, but you know what? A hit's a hit. I think that's what the Beatles said, too. Oh, di why did that one have to be the successful one? Well, a hit's a hit, John. Okay, we're going into the, the hole. I hope this isn't, like, flesh hole. I can't really tell because it's the Game Boy. Okay. Oh, no, it's a dragon. Well, maybe it's a flesh hole. It's hard to tell. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, actually, I'm well, I was gonna say I was fine. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ow. Ow. Double ow. Come on, come on. 
Come on, I can take this dude out. Yes! Yes, teabag! Teabag him! Toxic gamer. Yeah, they call me Chris Toxic Belmont. Born to be a hater. A hator. And, uh, last stage, I guess. Yeah, this is not a long game. This is not a long game at all. Ooh, pretty. Got, like, stained glass windows and everything. Ow. No, no. Ow! Die! Please. Oh, hey, you remember this? No, get out of here. Birds are not welcome in my house. The trick is, the trick with the window is that it's more about the design than the color. Okay, did I want that? I don't know. Uh-oh. 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 Uh-oh! Need some wall meat. Need- need a dispenser here. Ah, oh, the crusher. The crush you later. Because it crushes you later. Or right now, I don't know. Oh, but see this, this is the tricky one, because you gotta jump up on it. <laughs> Okay, I don't know... Like, do I want to go over... Yeah, I guess I do. I assume I can walk through the pole, because, yeah, you can't... You can't get through on this side. Oh, yeah, very, very curious about the rope. Oh, oh, okay. You gotta destroy it. Mario attack the chain. Mario attack the chain. <laughs> Can't wait to see that in HD. Man, the Mario RPG remake really just still feels so surreal. Does not feel like a real game that I'm going to be able to play soon. I didn't think they'd actually do it. Oh, that was a that was a tricky jump, but I pulled it off. Do not t When am I going to learn don't don't jump. You think that you need to jump, but this is a falsehood. Do not, do not jump onto this. I mean, it looks, like I said, it looks like a dangerous fall, but you just gotta do, like, this. This is very chill music for a level this late in the game. Especially when 
You've been listening to hard-ass Castlevania radio the whole game. Hard-ass Castlevania radio. We only play the songs that blow your entire ass off. Oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Go down, go down. Now, in retrospect, in retrospect, was that worth it? No, it was not. <laughs> I may have made an error in judgment somewhere along the way. Uh-oh, uh -oh. speaking of error in judgment. The bat can't hurt me when I'm on the rope. Well, I mean, he can hurt me, but he can't, like, kill me. Hmm. I could- I could use another life. I can only pray that I will receive one. I mean, this is a cool thing to do with the ropes, so I'll give them that. Okay, note to self. Axe is not worth it. <laughs> axe will make you die. It will kick you in the axe. I cannot believe I did not get hit. Ow. I, I guess I wasn't supposed to do that. That That's one thing I don't much care for with this game's level design. Is how many times it's just like... Yeah, but yeah, buddy, you can, you can jump here. You can do it. And then it's like, oh, no. No, you shouldn't have did it. <laughs> you shouldn't have did it, boy. I sure hope there is a life or wall meet in my future. That that heart is uh, that heart's going down. There's no way around it. Uh oh. Uh oh. Don't don't make me stand on the crumble. Okay, Spodler. Okay, that one is going to attempt to fire at me. Don't let it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No, no, no. Bird. Bird not welcome. As I have mentioned, there are many things in this world I will tolerate. Bird is not one of them. Yes, the axe, finally. Uh-oh. 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 No, I'm alive. I am alive. Ow. I'm not about to be! I'm not about to be. Can I get some meat? Oh, thank you. Thank you for the precious meat. But I have a feeling I'm about to get my, my ass kicked in anyway. Who knows? Any more meat? Any more meat you want to spare? Get me up to full? No? Okay. Actual dialogue. I'm surprised you made it this far. The rebirth of Dracula will occur soon. You cannot destroy me. Father. Oh, yep, yep. 
Yep. Yep, my- my- my shit is getting so thoroughly kicked in. Well, I mean, we gotta continue. Oh, hey, it doesn't take me all the way back to the start. That is surprisingly nice. I mean, this whole- this whole game is surprisingly nice compared to the first one. You- you can put that on the back- you can put that on the back of the box if you want. Castlevania 2 Belmont's Revenge. It is surprisingly nice. Castlevania 2 Belmont's Revenge. It respects that you are a person with things to do and places to be. I mean, this isn't true of me, but it could have been. And I appreciate Castlevania taking that into account. Ow. Ow. Of course, I am not playing well in the slightest. Okay, now, how do you get across there without getting hit? That's what I need to know. You might be able to walk that. You might be able to walk that. You can walk that. Oh, I think that's an extra life. A hidden extra life that I get. And I wasn't even trying to, really. So I got three lives. There we go. And then there's one of them scythe dudes up here. That one's easier to dodge. You can just kind of hang out, you know? <laughs> yeah, that that was not a good that was not a good run. Oh, this Castlevania 2. Yeah, I already played a uh, Simon... Simon game way back. If you would like to see that, the VOD is, as always, available. But you probably don't want to see that. Because my stream, my screams... As well as my streams, only get progressively better, which means my old ones are crappier. Yeah, but, I mean, the good news is, if nothing else, being embarrassed of your old stuff means that your new stuff is probably better. So you can at least take solace in that. Edited down the Barbie stream and it was painful. Yeah. Also, our attempts to... <laughs> Our attempts to game the algorithm with Barbie content does not seem to have worked all that well for us. But I guess it was worth a try. I mean, it's not like the Barbie game <laughs> that I played lasted longer than like 45 minutes, so... Okay, can I skip this? Yes, I can. Like I said, this game, this game surprises me a little bit. Oh, okay, they, that's right, they fall. Oh, and you whip, you whip and he whips. 
Honestly, any Castlevania game where you have to fight- Oh, it goes- It tries to go towards you. I am not- I am not doing well against Soli. Yeah, so the key is to stand, like, right by them. And then just sort of duck out of the way. Yeah, I, I think I got- I think I got the strategy at this point. Oh wait, do I- did I lose that? Oh, I think I lost it. Well, crap. Well, if I get another game over, I know the strategy. Oh wait, never mind, it's right here. But yeah, this is honestly a really cool fight. Belmont versus Belmont. The fight that should never have been. Oh crap. Oh no. Uh crud. Crud and poopy. Ah oh, crap. Well, that's not going well so far, but like I said, I know what I have to do, more or less. I mean, like I said, we've only been streaming for about an hour, so it's not like... This is a huge time sink or anything. This is honestly the hardest thing I've had to do in this game so far. Two hours later. <laughs> no, we're not gonna- we're not gonna get another Castlevania one. He just- oh, he whips. He whips and he nay nays. Okay, so... <laughs> not doing good on this so far, but like I said, I'm- I'm working out the strategy. I'm getting it in my brain. Working it out. Thinking about it. Like I said, if you guys have the patience to deal with this, so so do I, to be honest. Oh, oh no. Like, yeah, I'm not- I'm not salty. I mean, I wish I didn't have to do all this again, but it, it's not that much game. It's not that much content that I have to go through. Like I said, don't even bother with that. I mean, honestly, maybe it would be helpful if I could get it consistently, but... Thank you. Thank you, Bat. There's another axe that's way easier. True. Yeah. I'm mostly thinking about, like, this room. This is the room where it would be most handyful. Ow. I do want to get the one up that's in there, though. Ah! Well, I tried. And trying is half the battle. That- that scared the crap out of me. I- I peed myself a little bit. Not really. But it's funnier if I say it that I did. That's how comedy works, is say you- say you peed yourself.
And yeah, Twitch having some, like, formatting would be cool. But no, we're just gonna, like, have pre-roll ads or something, I don't know. Ow. Aw, oh, you... You took away my whip. Not very nice. I'm starting to think you don't like me very much. Oh, and I got... Well, okay, I got the regular whip, actually. Well, it, it's sort of the mid-whip. Wish I had the one that shoots the fireballs, but, you know, I'll take what I can get. Father! How come he can hit me, but I'm so bad at hitting him, hmm? Ow. <laughs> okay, yeah, this fight kind of hard. Like I said, by far, by far the hardest thing this game has had me do so far. Something of a difficulty spike, I, I, I will admit it. So, what you're saying is, don't have the high ground. Or maybe you do want the high ground, I don't know. Yeah, 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 yeah. Still gotta wait for the animation to play out, though. Well, this ain't a good- this ain't a good attempt. Holy crap. God, Salulu. Okay, maybe- maybe I don't have as fine a grasp on this as I was hoping I did. Hmm. Like, you want to keep your distance, but if you keep too much distance, you'll get hit by his knives. Yeah, I don't know what I was thinking with that one. Ow. Ow. <laughs> Ow. Hmm. Hmm. Turns out that Salulululu is kind of strong. He's kind of a strong man. I'm just gonna get really good at this part. Uh oh, uh oh, okay, I'm fine. I'm okay.
How many of the classic Castlevania games have you played? Uh, I played one through three. Uh, this one, the the other Game Boy one. I am getting my my ass kicked by this bat. <laughs> Holy crap! Um, <laughs> I played Rondo of Blood, and that might be it. No, I played a little bit of Chronicles. Ow. You should try blood. Oh yeah, I did I did play like the first level of that, but I didn't get super far. I figured I might save it for a stream one of these days. And I mean we're getting closer to that point. I'm thinking in October I might play Castlevania 4, which is another one I've never gone all the way through. This one I played like a large amount. Like I've gotten to the final final like castle area, but I've never actually beaten it. Never gotten to this part. Ow. Ow. You know, you know what screw this. Screw this. This this one is Bupkis. We're we're running it back. I mean the good news is if I can't beat this today, then I can just write down the password. This one actually has password backup. Which is funny, considering how short the game is, but, you know. Uh-oh, uh uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh. My skills are deteriorating. My powers... My power is failing! <laughs> okay. <laughs> this room has been taken care of. Like I said, if I could just take care of that guy... The bat! The freaking bat! <laughs> and my attempts to get this one up have cursed me into a life of pain and misery. I was so concerned trying to get a life that I lost a life. You know, it, it probably says- probably says something about society, I don't know what it is. What if the axe is worth it after all once you figure out the trick? I mean, that's what I'm saying, maybe. Uh-oh. Well, okay, I need that. That is unquestionable. Because I could- I could make it through that room a lot easier if I did that. But the problem is, this room becomes more difficult. I am so lucky these bats barely do any damage. Man, I wish this dude could climb faster. It would be lovely. If this man could climb, but I mean, I, 
He has... <clears throat> yes. Yes, of course. There's not much of a trick, you just gotta execute. <laughs> you just gotta be good at the video game. Ow. Okay, now then. Okay, now I have all the time in the world. Oh, oh, there's a secret room. There's a secret room up here. And I get to get the fireball whip. And I can meet it up. Oh, yeah. We found Dracula's secret stash. See, that's what I'm telling you, the secrets, baby. Is there more secrets above the secret room? You know, it's worth a check. It is worth a check. And then the game pulls a Star Tropics and just kills me for trying. Okay, no there is not. There, There's no nested secret, it is just the one secret. Don't get greedy. Again, my attempts to get the one up. But that's good to know about. That is good to know about. That actually might make a big difference in the fight against... Because if I can have the fireball whip... Then I can attack him from much farther away. At least for a little while. There was no monkey. Do not lie to me. But yeah, I, I put that in because I, uh, I was expecting to play Donkey Kong Country by now, but... Like I said, I got important buizness to take care of before I can do it. Trust me, it will- it will all be very slightly, vaguely worth it. Well, that's not good, but we- we do know where the wall meat is. We know where the wall meat is. <laughs> ha ha. See you later, suckers. Yes. Yes, that's grand. You know what, you know what, we're, we're just not getting the life. <laughs> well, we just gotta accept that, I think. And you see? You see the power that I wield? I mean, okay, it's a little bit weaker than the actual strike, but you know. The one-up is bait. I mean, it's supposed to be hard to get. It's not supposed to be something you just get for free. It is there to reward a skilled player, which I am not. <laughs> I 
Oh, but I can go ahead and, like, remove the spider in advance. With the power that I wield. Might not be a good idea to, honestly. Mmm, safety. Uh-oh! I could probably respawn it. Uh-oh! No way, I just didn't go far enough. No, no, no! Oh, it put me in the hole. And now I don't have the fireball anymore, great. Great. That's the thing, that's the one thing about the fireball, you get one shot. Do not miss your chance to blow. I underestimated the, the Craigly block. I did not realize the true power that it had. There we go. Uh-oh, I have... Man, I am goofing this one up. Hard. I am goofing it up so bad. Gorsh. I think all that troubleshooting did a number on me. That's what, I, that's what I'm gonna blame. Can you, like, enter my whip? Thank you. You get- the problem is you get overconfident at this early part. And then you think- you think it's all just easy. But it is not easy. In fact, it is quite the challenge. But you forget that. You forget where you came from. And you can't do that. Okay, see, that's- that's the real trick here. The real trick is I get the spider in advance. Oh god. Oh god. Okay, I'm fine. I'm actually fine. Okay, so we're not in the best state, but you know, we can we can gather knowledge. We can gather knowledge against Lululu. I wonder if I might want to keep the axe, honestly. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try going in with axe strats. See what we can do with that. Can I go over here? No, not really. Oh. Honestly, Axe might be the way to go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, no! God, that was so close. That was so close. No, 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 listen, listen. 
This time, we got it. We got it. This man is toast. And probably with some jelly on it, if I can be honest with you. Jelly or butter? You know what? We can have both. I don't got anywhere to be tomorrow. But yeah, we have- we have the strat. And that's all you really need in this world of ours. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. And- and not to do that. Ideally, don't do that. But if you're gonna do that, don't do it too badly. Ow. I did not jump in time. <laughs> I am so lucky that I found that meat up there. <laughs> yeah, act strats. Okay, now, I have a plan. Okay, never mind. It is, it is very tight. It is very tight, the spot you have to hit. Okay, so far so good. Okay, wait for it to do. Wait for it to do. Oh god! I hate those two spiders in particular. Oh no 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 okay, I'm fine. I was I was never afraid. Okay, so this might be slightly more of a Castlevania 1 situation than I thought. But in my defense, most of it is playing the level again. Okay, I mean, let's be real, it's, it's not as bad as that. No, 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 see, see, you gotta...
You gotta like be. You know, I don't even want. I don't even want this attempt anymore. It's it's those spides. It's the spodlers. They taunt me. Getting some sick rope burn right now. I don't even know. That might be like chains or something. I don't actually know what that's supposed to be. Ow. I was so concerned about not getting hit by the bat that I let the scythe man hit me, which is probably even worse. Probably slightly even worse. Now, please, Jesus, can I, can I please make it to the boss with this upgrade? I did not mean to throw that. Yes! I mean, if it wasn't for the spiders, I'm going to blame the spiders, and specifically the spiders. The rest of these guys, they mean nothing to me. See, see that bird? You see how I took him down? He means nothing. Nothing. This, this spider. He's nothing. It's only those other two. I mean, I don't even know why I grabbed that, because I'm wasting... I'm wasting the axe doing that. Wait, hang on. Actually... Actually... I'm a genius. Hold on. Oh, no! Oh, no! They took away my fireball! Well, you know what, whatever. The axe. The axe is the strategy. Okay? The fireball is not necessary. It, it, I, I would like to have it, but it's not necessary. Showtime. I like how they make you grab that to summon the boss. I'm dead. I'm so- I'm, I'm dead. I- I have to be more aggressive. Now, 
when I'm fighting this guy. But yeah, without the axe, I don't know if I, <laughs> I don't know if I stand a chance. Yes, 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 yes. I got, and then I jump right into his knives. Wait, hang on, hang on. I might have an idea. Who is this guy anyway? Uh, this is the main character's son, who has been, like, turned into a demon by Dracula. But honestly, attacking him when he jumps might be a good idea. <laughs> Craig Belmont. And yeah, I feel like I should be able to hit him when he's like that. <laughs> like, it, it's touching his feet. Can I at least lob his toes off? God, I, I'm so close. I can taste it. I can taste the victory. But like I said, I can taste it a lot better when I have the axe, which I only get one shot with. Because they said... You know, they said, gotta... I don't know what they said. Like, I don't know what to do against this guy when he does that. Like, I don't know what to do half the time. You know, I just gotta have the axe. That's the only way around it. Yeah, like, this game really is stupidly easy up until this moment. So yeah, just, just have the axe. Get the knife. You wanna use the lance? Get the knife. Honestly, I don't think I even need to get this axe anymore. Well, I mean, I guess I could use it against, you know, the bat in the next room. Like so. Let me get through this room taking no damage. Which means the meat is now entirely useless, but, you know, whatever. Whatever, do not care. Don't, don't care, didn't take damage.
Yeah, I got it. I got it. They should bring back the DSS system, but fix the balance. Uh, that was the thing in Circle of the Moon, right? The cards. The heart of the cards. Okay, also the axe is good for here, too. I forgot. You don't get the axe in here until later in the room. Yeah, I, I remember when I first played through Circle of the Moon, I, I didn't get most of the cards. And that kind of sucks, because there's a lot you could do with them. But like you say, they didn't want to... They didn't want to give it to you. You can make the camera scroll a little farther each time. The game was stingy in general. Honestly, Circle of the Moon feels like they saw the complaints about uh, Symphony of the Night being too easy, and they overcompensated in the exact opposite direction. So you had a game that was just impossible. Also, I got the I got here with the fireball. Let's go. I mean, I'm probably going to get hit once and then immediately lose it, but... You know. Mm, pardon me. Come on. Come on. Come on. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. And then watch it doesn't even do damage to him. No, it does. It does. Oh, wait, I still got it! Oh, no, 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 no! No, no, no! God! So lo 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 So lay little, little, little. I raised my boy too well. He's too powerful. Everyone, please stop praying for my son. He's too powerful now. Okay, get out of there. Get out of there real quick. Real quick. Just threaten to take away his technology. There is no technology! Because, yeah, I just don't feel like I'm doing enough damage without... without my gear. He's too powerful. I mean they didn't have Game Boys back then? No. Oh, why did I why did I allow that to happen? I mean, he moves in a pattern, like, he doesn't seem to chase after you, at least, so... There's that, I guess.
I mean, for whatever little that's worth. Oh, wait, wait. I'm having an idea here. Well, you know, if my idea could ever hit him. Like, you could- like, you could get him to stand in the holy water while he's whipping you. While you're his whipping boy. Okay, here we go again. Oh, hey. No damage there. I have achieved total mastery of this part, though. I apologize for being stuck on this part. It is probably quite dull. But maybe there's also some tension to be had. Yeah, Miles, you've ruined my life. <laughs> That'll be $50 to remove the curse. I ain't got that kind of money. I'll just have to be cursed forever. Yeah, see, complete and utter mastery of the game's mechanics. Now I just need to not get hit 300 freaking times by Solel. Not even trying to pronounce his name, Solel. Not even trying at this point. Honestly, Castlevania 1 would have been easier to beat if I remembered how to do the cheese. Ow. You know, that's not good when that happens. Oh, 
Fuck! I, I wasn't sure if he was gonna jump down or not. I should probably observe, like, the order in which he goes up and down. But listen, I am getting closer. I think it's RNG. I mean, maybe, but I swear he jumps up and down in specific patterns. Like, see, the first time... He always, he always jumps up. Yeah, see? And then he jumps down, yep. Yeah, and then he goes to the left here. And then he'll jump down. Ow. Ow. I'm getting a feel for it, though. What time is it right now? It's 10. RNG with the same seed every time. <laughs> I think the trick if you want to, like, whip him is to do it when he's jumping. Or when he's falling down. God, I, I'm getting so close. If I just didn't have to play through the entire part before... I mean, there's an alternate universe where it makes me play through the whole level again, and then this would have truly been the worst thing ever. So sometimes... Sometimes we do live in the good timeline. Or at least the not the worst timeline. Ow. Ow. See that that's the thing, you can't be high up. Because he will he will get you. You know, maybe that's the strategy is like jump over him. Like before he goes to the right that time, jump over and already be on the left. Ow. Every- every time. Well, actually, no, not every time. I haven't been doing that. Stay on the top platforms where- so his knives don't get you. Hmm. I mean, I'm trying to visualize. Oh, stay over him. Well, I guess the thing is, you gotta be prepared for when he jumps up to the top platform, is the main thing. Because this is a thing he will do. Ah, oh, crap. Now I've wasted time! 
which I have not been doing up until this point, I should have you know. You might have enough time to react to him coming up. Hmm. Maybe. Maybe. I will have to see. Yeah, I figured I figured out how to do that. <laughs> yeah, destroying the candles, that's something I do now. I am so glad that I figured that out because that makes this part so much easier. Like, comically easier. Okay, come on, let's, let's, let's go. Let's do it! Come on! Yes! Yes! Shield! Yes! Shield! We finally did it, boys. But there's more. Ouch! What am I doing? Oh, father. Since Dracula cannot use my powers, Dracula will use the power of the four castle spirits. Hurry up, quickly. I was legitimately kind of shaking while I was doing that. All right, here we go. This might be the same as the last game. I mean, if nothing else... If nothing else, there's not a stage to play through before we do this. Oh, 
Okay, yeah, I can see why this might be a problem. But yeah, like I said, at least we don't have a stage to play through. We can just, we can just keep cracking at it. Where is his hitbox? In his head. It's usually where it is. But they do give you the fire whip. Yeah, where where do you stand? I I couldn't tell you. Makes a little noise when you swipe at him. I guess Oh, <laughs> I was standing right in him. I guess you want to be as far away as possible. That seems like the best strategy. This background's kind of badass, I'll be real with you. <laughs> I like it. But yeah, no time wasted. We can just do attempt after attempt. Okay, uh, that didn't work. <laughs> yeah, okay. Can I stand here? No. Oh, but that worked. Uh oh. Ow. But I can get some extra hits in on him. Usually it's the corner here. I'm finding. Oh, yeah, okay. Don't don't get greedy. That's the main thing. Pardon, pardon me. Pardon me. Uh, you like how they give me hearts, but no sub weapon? That's pretty cool. Okay, not not for that one at least. Okay. Oh, okay. yeah. Cool. 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 <laughs> cool attempt. Cool run. Maybe there's a secret if I go up. No. I need to figure out where you gotta stand for this first attack. Okay, so maybe like right here. Ow. Ow. So, like, right in the middle of that platform. 
<laughs> Ow. Yeah, you just you just gotta figure out where you can stand. And yeah, this boss is not terribly good. <laughs> not a good boss. Like, towards the right here, I think, is where I can stand. Nope. Gotta be further than that. Nope. Oh, always goes to the same locations in the same order. You know, it does seem like that. Now that you mention it. If nothing else, I can make a chart. <laughs> I can make a chart of, where, of what exactly I have to do. Yes. Ah, uh, crap. And then he goes right here. Yep. Ah, oh, crap. That was that was close. Oh no! Do not put me inside, Dracula. Ow. Yeah, like I said, the game's so easy until you get to this part. Until you get to... And then it just... it goes straight to hell. But I mean, at least there's a password. You know, so if we can't... if we can't do it today, we can come back later. Dracula sprite here giving me some real Ganondorf vibes. Oh no, wait, I need to do damage. Oh, that's where you go for that. Oh. Ow. Oh, almost. Oh. Oh, no, 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 don't. Don't be there. Oh. The, the magic's happening, boy. Oh, never mind. I don't mind this boss as much as Solil. It's just very trial and error. Yeah, I mean, I guess that's the thing, though, is... It's a little, little is hard. But I don't know, there, there was a method to the madness, I guess. This is just kind of like, you have to memorize where to stand. There's just not enough time to react to this otherwise. Not even trying with that one. Oh, if I hadn't jumped, I think I would have been okay. <laughs> I 
But yeah, I mean, I'm starting to form the pattern in my mind. I, like, it, it's starting, like, the, the wrinkles are forming. And we, like I said before, we got a real good turnaround time on this fight. We gotta, like, we can just walk right back over, try it again. I will say the thing, again, the thing about Solo is that you had to go through that whole shebang every time you wanted a few more attempts at him. You know, I'm shocked that the balls don't hurt you on the way back. Like, I am actually shocked that that is not the case. Ah, oh, crap, I didn't want to go here. You have to be further right on that platform if you want that to work. Okay, now where can you be when he does that? Like when you're- when he's up top in the middle, I need to figure out. You see that? That's me right now. I do like the background. I mean, not just the skeletons, but I also like the, the little wavy thing that moves. That's pretty nice. You thought I was just going to start talking about it all over again. Oh wait, no, I know what to do when, you, when he's here. I, I'm doing it right now. Oh, wait, wait, I did it. Crap, I didn't get a hit in on him. Stand right here, yeah. Oh, no, need to be further to the right. Yeah, you can tell we're, we're getting somewhere with this. But I keep uh, wasting my attempt. Oh, no, wait, that's not there. We're getting somewhere. We got this. We got this. It is only a matter of time. I got greedy. I got greedy. No, he goes up there. You stupid fool. Okay, that doesn't work. <laughs> Ow. I, well, I dodged the ball. Fortunately, I landed on Dracula's very painful face. But yeah, he, lo he looks a little Ganondorfy in this game, I feel like. Man, what if they made a sequel to Zelda 2 on the Game Boy? That would have been wacky. 
I would have liked that. Okay, don't get, don't get, don't get greedy. Okay, that's where you stand for that. There we go. Ow. Ow. No, just just gonna focus on dodging this one. Very close, we're very close. Just gotta execute just a little bit better. Killed by great. Yeah, if he goes up top, if he goes at top, just don't bother. That's what I'm learning here. Just don't bother. You cannot do damage and get down fast enough. I mean, you probably can, but I, I can't. Oh wait, I got, I, I'm sorry, I forgot. That wasn't greed, that was stupidity. Yeah, it's, it's... Okay, it, it is hard to get down there in time. Not far enough to the right. I should tr probably try to, like, hit him with a fireball more often. That may be a viable strategy. A stratagem. I'm not sure if it is, honestly. I don't know, it might- it might only be the actual whip that does damage. Aw, oh, crap. Oh, holy crap. You know what, I'm just- I'm taking it. No, this time I can get into position. I can assume the position.
Ow. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Suck, suck it! Suck my whip! And there we go. Thank you, thank you. But time bomb set, get out fast! And now father and son may reunite. And the torch may be passed. But you don't never get to play as him. Push a little off the cliff. Listen, no, it's not his fault. It's not his fault. Dracula gave him the bad juju. It happens to everybody. The war. Oh no, not the war! Is over. Oh. Dracula's. Scheme was foiled, and his plans for world domination have failed because of the combined power of Christopher and Sol Soliu. Hmm, which one is it? Also, he didn't do shit. He- uh, it was- that was me. I did all that. Once again, the wor- the day is saved thanks to... The Belmont Boys. And then... Soliu has... Overcome the... Dark Curse and Will Why don't you want me, man? Continue to Fight I was minding my damn business eating some damn fruit Dracula and his forces Soon after, the Belmont family has a long, oh, history, oh, okay, of vampire hunters. Yeah, it's kind of their thing. Kind of what they do. The legend will always continue. And then X and Zero walk up and they're like, Hey, you guys are almost done with this cliff. Well, we kind of, we need it for our ending. Sigma's, Sigma's due in here in like an hour or two. So, gonna, <laughs> gonna need you to wrap this up. White screen staff. Oh god, it's gonna be the slowest credits of all time. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you are gonna read their names and you are gonna like it. Hey, I mean, this was the only way they could do transparency. <laughs> I mean, they had to do- here, here, let me- let me help this a little bit. No, not that. Uh... What am I looking for here? Hmm, I swear there's like... 
I may have to make it. I may have to make it myself. Hang on, hang on, I got this. We're gonna make it, we're gonna make it more cinematic. Oh god, that's awful. That is so awful. Get that, get... <laughs> like, that hurt my eyes a little bit. <laughs> And like I said, on an on an original Game Boy with its ghosting screen, this this wouldn't have looked like this. It would have looked kind of just like, you know, like a different shade. Today I learned that the Super Game Boy 2 has the same sound effects as the original. Yeah, it's it's not too different. It's just like a couple minor adjustments. Oh wow. And it actually lets you go back in if you want to. I don't know if there's any reason to do it. Because, like, it's not like there's any upgrade. Like, is there- is it hard mode? Is it hard mode? I mean, I'm not seeing anything different. But here, uh, let me just give you a quick little tour of this. I'll- I'll show you. Because, you know, like I said, these were Japan exclusive, so you had to import them. This is what it- this is what it looks like. This is what I'm seeing, basically. And then you got this here, you know, these are your color palettes. And here's the different borders you get. I mean, obviously you got Game Boy. You can just have black if you want. Which is more than can be said of Nintendo Switch Online. Uh, you got this. So you can have... Instead of hard mode, game should give you the same levels, but now there's no enemies. <laughs> oh, super easy mode. But yeah, here's uh, Game Boy, but you took the shell off of it for some reason. Um, palm tree. Kind of Yoshi's Island or Tetris attack looking. You got... The game, the temple of Game Boy. Oh, I skipped one. You can play in the swamp. Play a Game Boy in the swamp. You can have the gears. Oh, no, that's just that's just the control menu. That's exactly the same. Uh, dolphin. Yeah, you can have dolphins. You have a little doodum running around if you want. Uh, the, the Colosseum. They won't let me do any of that. Uh, you can, uh, draw. Just like on the other one. Yeah, so that's pretty good. Cool. Actually, let me, let me show you something real quick. Because somebody told me about this. I forgot who it was. Might, might have been Kovar. I don't, I don't remember. But... No, it was it was Josh, Geek, Geek Critique Josh that told me that. But if you get a uh, Super Nintendo mouse, this is the Hyperkin like laser mouse. It's like a Super Nintendo mouse, but it's got a laser. How come you don't have a laser, Woody? And if you plug this in to slot B, kind of a tight fit because Hyperkin products are good. But let me see. Let me, let me see here. Oh, okay, uh... The... The mouse is freaking out. So far, this is not working. Oh, okay, here we go, here we go. So yeah, you can use the mouse, like this, see? You can use the Super Nintendo mouse. Yeah, I, I, I never knew about that. Oh, nice shirt. Uh, thank you. It's the Mar Martinios. So yeah, let, like I can, uh...
No, that looks that looks awful. I'm not sure about the the fine control of this mouse. Trying to trying to draw Wario. It's Hyperkin, you should only ever expect okay. Yeah, after the Retron 5, I learned that lesson. But honestly, they're the only ones who make something like this, as far as I'm aware. Which is to say, a Super NES mouse, but with a laser. Because... There's a little button on the bottom, I don't know what that does. Maybe it affects the sensitivity. Oh yeah, this is- oh, that's way better. That is way freaking better. I mean, not fantastic, but way better than that. So I guess that's a sensitivity button. But yeah, I, I feel like I wouldn't mind seeing some other people make this sort of product. Like, because I hate mouse balls. I really do. Yeah, so this is this is low. This is low sensitivity. And then you press it again. And this is high sensitivity. Which is much better in my opinion. But yeah, it's not... Not the most responsive thing. Because as you can see, like I'm trying to do like a curve. And it just kind of <laughs> goes flat. I don't know. Whoa! Whoa! A whole stream of drawing Wario noses. I mean, I thought about, like, streaming Mario paint. You can make your own- you can make your own border. So, if you wanted to play- If you wanna make- if you wanna play Castlevania, but you can't see half the screen, I'm just gonna jiggle my webcam while I'm doing this. Cause an earthquake. Castlevania, but you can't see the left half of the screen. Here you go. Anyway, there you go. That's the... That's the Super Game Boy 2. Pretty cool. And that is also Castlevania 2. So many 2s were just... Synchronizing the two-osity of the whole thing. Anyway, next time, uh, I don't know, Commander Keen, Donkey Kong, whichever comes first. I don't know, something's, something's kind of... You hear that? Something's kind of wiggling in there. <laughs> oh, and it's on Tuesday. Yeah, that's true. Castlevania Tuesday. See, see everybody. Wait, where's my mouse? Here it is.